Hello everyone, welcome to Geeker Mac. If you are still using a Windows PC without pop count CPU instructions and it has a NVIDIA GPU from the Maxwell generation, installing the latest NVIDIA driver version R555 plus display drivers causes a BSOD boot loop until it reaches a Windows recovery. This is discovered and shared by the Bob Pony on its X handle. Even the same information is confirmed by NVIDIA on its support page. In case you are planning to install the latest driver from NVIDIA, then I suggest you to check if your PC support pop count instructions to avoid bug check or BSOD. Here is how you can do that. But before we move forward, if you find this video useful in any way, please consider subscribing to the channel as this encourages me in creating more similar videos. Alright, first of all, you need to head over to Microsoft this page and download the Core Info app. After that, you need to right click and select extract all to get the required app. In the same folder, you need to right click and select open in terminal. In the terminal window, you need to copy paste this command that is period backslash core info 64 space dash F and hit enter. If you are launching the app for the first time, a license agreement will appear. Click agree to proceed. Windows terminal will show you information about system CPU. Here locate pop count entry and check next to it. If it says support pop count instructions, then you can install the latest driver from Nvidia. On the other hand, if it says not supported or something similar, then avoid installing the driver as this will cause BSOD after installing the same drivers. I hope you find this information useful. Why don't you try these instructions and let me know in the comments if your PC support pop count instructions or not. So that's all about this video. If you find this video useful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel to get notifications about more similar videos. Thanks for watching.